Sydney, Australia. Thousands of holidaymakers and locals were bedding down at beaches in fire-ravaged Southeast Australia on New Year's Eve after fleeing deadly blazes that ripped through popular tourist areas and cut off several towns in seaside communities along a 200-kilometer, 135-mile strip of coast. Terrified crowds, wrapped in blankets and wearing makeshift face masks, sought refuge from the inferno near the water. Some with boats earlier took to the sea in near darkness, hoping to find safety. As one of the worst days yet in Australia's months-long bushfire crisis prompted a military deployment to help relief efforts, three people have died, five more are unaccounted for, and scores of properties were feared destroyed after a brutal 24 hours in which flames reached well-populated towns like Batemans Bay. Normally bursting with visitors during Australia's summer holidays, we've got literally hundreds of thousands of people up and down the coast, taking refuge on the beaches and in surf clubs," said Shane Fitzsimmons, commissioner of the New South Wales Rural Fire Service, in the majority of these cases. We're being told that people will be sleeping over at these clubs, surf life-saving Australia's.